yo what's going on sexy sam letter squad it's your poo poo pp boy here sam dude playing bear insanity and i got a little story to tell you so today it was it's it started as a, a normal day and it turned into something atrocious nah i'm kidding it wasn't that bad but actually it was kind of funny because i took appa you know, my, my dog had him for a while now. Hopefully you know who it is. Uh, I took Alpa to the groomers to get groomed because we got a little sweater for him. And if we didn't get him groomed, then we couldn't put the sweater on him because he would be too hot. So doesn't matter. Whatever. We got him groomed. I went after four hours. I went after four hours to go pick him up after we finally got the call. And they had this little special going on in the groomers today where for five bucks, you could get a little picture taken with your dog in front of uh, like Christmas presents and a tree and all styled up and cute like it. It was it was very funny. And I really wanted to do it for Appa. So I did. Turns out there was another Bijan in there. Appa is a Bijan. And uh when I when I went to pick him up after I got the call four hours after like I said we dropped him off which you know should have been a red flag immediately um I go to pick him up they give me a female dog Appa's a male by the way just so everyone's aware he is a male you don't you don't scare me home dog okay anyways so yeah he's a male and they gave me a picture of a girl dog sitting in front of the tree and they're like, here's Appa. I was like, this, this is Appa. And they, they were like, yeah, that that's Appa's picture. And I was like, okay, I guess. And then they, I'm like, oh, or, or they said, all right, I'm gonna go in the back. I'm gonna get Appa now for you. I was like, perfect, perfect. Let me see him. Cause if it was the dog in the picture, I was gonna say, you know what? Maybe you need to, Maybe you need to rethink the cut a little bit. You know what I mean? And they come out with uh, with a girl dog. Hand me her and say, here's your dog. Here's Appa. And I look them dead in the face and go, this is not Appa. <laughs> and the, they look at me. They look at me dead in my face and say, uh, yeah, it is. Meanwhile, still no penis, right? Definitely not Appa. <laughs> And so after like a minute of back and forth, they take the, the dog that they assumed was Appa and the picture of the dog that they assumed was Appa back. And a couple minutes later, they bring out my boy who, I don't know, I guess must've been stocked on the shelf in the back or something. Cause it took him a while to find him, I guess. And they come out with him and just freaking hand him to be like, they're like, they didn't mess up. And then they're like, well, actually you already paid for the photo. So if you don't mind stepping outside for a few minutes while we take it. Oh my God. Oh my God. I waited four hours to get given the wrong dog. It was, it was a, it was a crazy experience. I don't know why they ever, I feel like here's the biggest thing about it. We've been taking him to the same place since we bought him. Like literally since he was eight weeks old, we've been taking him to the same place. There is no shot that you still don't know what he looks like <laughs> or the fact that you don't even know his gender. It's crazy. Anyways, that happened today. It was very funny and also scared the shit out of me for a little bit because I didn't know if I was going to get my pup back. Hello, that's hello. How are you away from me? Wow, I do a ton of damage. You're fast. Oh, he, he did alt, I guess. I had no cooldowns up. But that's fine. That's fine. Also, I read the comments. Um, I love when you guys actually tell me what you want to see. Because it makes my life so easy. Um, that being said... I'm not doing what you commented. <laughs> you guys said you wanted to see auto attack out Posh. Shiv is screaming do it. While bringing me 
delicious Parmesan and rosemary buttered toast. Um, so I guess I'm going to have to. But the reason I'm not doing that right now is because... Hold on, is this mine? It is. It's because I, uh, I didn't really want to lose. It's not my usual queue time. I don't know who I'm going to be up against. And I decided, you know what? I mean, it's not like I know who I'm going to be up against when I queue in the mornings, obviously. But, um, I decided I'm going to try to do what I did last night, staying up forever for. And that's the no cooldown Baron game. Basically, it's just Chronos Pendant. Um, it's Chronos Pendant, Polynomicon, Boomba's Hammer, and Genji's. The reason you get Genji's is because I know obviously you're you're capped out on cooldown with just the Chronos Pendant and the Boomba's Hammer, but the ben the the Benji's <laughs> the Genji's when it procs actually gives you an extra second or two off your abilities, which is the whole point of the video. So. Dude, why not? Uh, hey, can you come here? No. Okay. Uh, my dad told me you're not allowed to do this, so sorry. Yeah, I live. It wasn't pretty. You're dead. Let's go. Huge kill. Actually, gigantic kill. That might give me my blue buff. I don't know. He took my blue buff before, and I don't really know when it spawns. I'm hoping the show or the 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 mini map icon that shows is actually correct. It turns out it was, so I'll get my blue buff. Thank you. Don't really care too much about red. <clears throat> Damage isn't the name of the game today, which is weird because it like 99% of the time is. Okay, there's no shot that actually happened. I rooted him with my three and then missed both of my abilities on a rooted target. Yeah, I'm deleting the video. Guess you guys will never see that. <laughs> Adam. He does have tier two defense. Can you actually get that that fast? Yes, but you can't. Oh, my, my heal didn't hit. Darn tootin', man. Darn tootin'. It's so good. <laughs> Bingo beads. Man. I don't know if you guys have a Costco near you or anything, because I don't know where you live. I mean, I do, but I'm not going to tell anyone. Um, if you have a Costco near you, and obviously a membership, you should go in there and buy... What are they? They're Parmesan and Rosemary? I think they're... I, you should go buy the olive oil and rosemary bread loaves. They are so good. It's, it's literally... Is you don't even have to put anything on them. Just toast them. Maybe if you want, put butter. But you, you generally you don't have to put anything. It's so good. Yeah. Hit. Oh, I hit that. We're chilling. If he ults me, if he ults me, am I scared? I don't think so. I think we're game. Hey, yeah, boom! Pop like a zit. Even beads that too, and we still killed him. Dude, he has thorns, and he already has defense online too. A little bit scary. I didn't even get boss minion there. Almost spawned. Not quite though. When did I get four kills? What the heck? All right, all right, all right. Next item. Next item, Genji's probably. Just help me live a little bit. 
And I want to get Genji's anyways. I know I'm overcapping cooldown by 10%, but I honestly don't. The meme deserves it. Uh, he's going to ult. I'm going to bees and run. You don't own me. You also don't scare me. Okay, never mind. I missed everything. <clears throat> How much is Genji's? I think it's 2250. If I remember right. 2200. Okay. Red buff spawns soon. He has no ult, so I'm not really scared of any kind of fight that he wants to bring to me. I think I just root him and then like 2-3 him and... Or 2-1 uh, him. Okay, you can Thorns. So I'm fine by that. You still literally don't scare me at all. Oh my god. <laughs> my cooldowns are already so fast and I don't even have the Boomba's hammer yet. Holy crap. I swear, this is actually such a good build. I've done it, I think, once before. Well, I've done it a couple times before, but I think I've only done it one time on video before. Um, I'll go poly. Just trying to get my food. Thing is paw on my arm. <laughs> he was by my desk. He saw his eyeballs. Yeah, no, he's trying. He's trying to munch. Respect, brother. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna hate on my dog for trying to eat some some better tasting food. I've had his food and it's not good. <laughs> you know, like, but I don't know. You know, maybe dogs have different taste buds. Mm, he's playing very defensive now. I don't do very much damage to him. Yet. And again, my goal is not to do damage. It's just to annoy. Doing a pretty solid job of that so far. Hmm. Laugh at me? You actually laugh at me? Why Why do you laugh at me when you're down 4 kills and 1.5k gold as Oleron? Little sus. Wanna fight me? On deck. Hmm. Hmm. He used his beads, his thorns, and his alt in that fight. I couldn't actually. I was gonna turn and use my three-two combo on him. So that I could get uh, a heal and movement speed, but his thorn stopped me. <laughs> I need a divine. I need a divine. He's too much healing. I do want Polly though. Go. That's a big kill. It doesn't give me Phoenix or anything, so I guess it's not like a super giant kill, but let's secure the red buff. Which is pretty good. Dude, my damage on buffs is so good. Oh, it's Boomba's hammer, obviously. It's gonna be good. <clears throat> Blue buff is spawning. This blue buff. I would love to get Boomba's hammer now, but I don't think I can just yet. <clears throat> I wonder if he's doing if he wants to do bull demon or not. 
Did he just back? That's a weird back. Alright, I'm gonna clear this wave and then I'm gonna get Divine here. I think I'm gonna go Divine instead of Polly just because he's got so much healing. Divine is gonna be better. <clears throat> better right now. <clears throat> oh, we got Telekines. Yikes. A little bit spooky. But once I get my Boomba's Hammer online, we are vibing. And I mean that in the most genuine way possible. Hello? Oh my god. He literally beads. He beads and tried to run out of my ult. And it still did almost a thousand damage to him. You cannot escape me. I am inevitable. I'm only... 500 gold away from my Boomba's hammer. And that's when you guys are going to see the real annoying thing about this build. <clears throat> and I mean this in the nicest way possible. But he might as well put down his keyboard because there's nothing he can do the second I get Boomba's hammer online. He's straight up screwed. Like, it's just that. It, that's just how it is. You are dead and there is nothing you can do. So stop while you're ahead. In this case, while well, you're behind, but still, stop. Here we go. Level 20. 1500 gold. Boomba's hammer acquired. Time to demolish the enemy. I don't have Polly yet, so the build's not completely uh, finished. But, but having the Boomba's hammer... And the Genjis and the Poly, or I'm not not the Poly, sorry, the the Boomba's Hammer, the Pendant, and the the Genjis. Having those three things, that's pretty much all you need. I'm now a huge damage dealing, no cooldown having fiend. Guess who doesn't scare me? You, by the way. I'm not even gonna kill you with that. Just Boomba's Hammer, baby. Look at that. Look at that. I just no cooldowns. There's no I could have I could have killed him with the ult. I chose not to. Instead, I'll use three more cooldowns just to do the same job the ult could have done. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh again, let me know what you want to see in the comments. I will do the attack speed outwash video. And um Rip 3 MMR. And yeah. See you guys next time. Peace.